our love. Try a different it, word. A different word than expressed. Okay. Um, declared. We declared our love for each other. All we did was speak it. We, we, well, we did kiss. Well, go ahead. But the, <laughs> Go, go on with the story. Okay, very good. <laughs> that was a really good kiss. <laughs> anyway, we, we, uh, I remember that kiss. Go on with the story. <laughs> I'll be on my deathbed going, the kiss, the kiss. <laughs> that was a new one. There you you people <laughs> laugh at him and it encourages him. Quit laughing at him. It was amazing. I loved it. I loved the personal level that they go on, like they make you do the dance thing and stuff, that was really fun. Yeah. Starting it out and just getting you warmed up. You are the sunshine of my life. <laughs> Don't encourage her! Don't encourage her! <laughs> well, instead we met each other. What? what? Okay, then! Then Better we met work. each other! It felt like they were just talking to us, you know, for our marriage and things and everything. You know, it's, 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 it's hard to put into words, but it just seemed like everything was for us, you know. So it was really, it was really powerful for us. If you are sleeping, send me your dreams. If you are laughing, send me your smile. This is good stuff, right? She's sending it. If you're eating, send me a bite. Because my mom volunteers at the hospital, and sometimes she's bored. She does things like this. Okay? If you're eating, send me a bite. If you're drinking, send me a sip. If you're crying, send me your tears. I love you. <laughs> Serious, right? 75, they've been married over 50 years. Here's my dad's response. I'm on the toilet, here's the box. <laughs> They're just hilarious. Like it's not, you don't just sit here and get tips. You have fun. Yeah. And even, okay, even the parents of God himself, okay? Jesus' parents, Joseph and Mary, all right? They were messed up. Do you remember the story where they left Jesus in Jerusalem for three days? They didn't, they, 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 it's three days, you know, it's not like, hey, have you seen Jesus? No, not for three days, they didn't even ask the question. It can help change your marriage. I mean, even if you take away one thing from a conference like this, it could change everything about your marriage. I did ask Laura about six months ago, I said, honey, when we first got married, you'd laugh at everything I would say. I could make you laugh in an instant. When did I go from amusing to annoying? <laughs> I, I want to know. At the altar. At the altar. <laughs> Actually, people were like, oh, this is just to celebrate your marriage. It's not really a fix it. And I actually kind of disagree like it with was. that. It felt more like a fix it. More like for an us. encouragement. Like, Almost like an encouragement yeah, fix it. Like, yeah. like you, you know, can do this. These are the hope, tools. So. It is good for us. Someone offends the other. We never talk about it. We just try and deal with it on our own. We let it go, or we don't deal with it. We don't have a conversation about it. We might try and have conversation. We probably even try to have inti intimate times. But it can't be meaningful and authentic if you haven't forgiven and restored and engaged. But I think the ride home will have a lot more conversation. Yeah, I think they appeal to all ages. I mean, fun appeals to everyone, so, yeah.